everyone we've only got two to go before the boss we've got the great sage one on this level um i like my guys are already in the middle so let's just go ahead and start let's see what happens um again standard drop i want to get my abyss demon over there quickly because i know my landslide's going to be in trouble here in a second uh frozen but he did not go to pangoliate okay that's good um Let's see how this works here. It looks like it's, it seems to be taking a while and too much rage, uh, really. I might uh, have to bring my heroes over and drop them, bring them closer to that drop spot. Uh, let's see, because the next wave has already spawned. And let's see, uh, my team is beating on something there, which may be a landslide. Uh, yeah, it is a landslide. It just taunted. So now uh, my team split up, which isn't good. Um, and again, wow, it's really laggy. Okay. Um, so basically, this wave is coming in and smashing me. And I finally killed that landslide, but it looks like uh, this is bad. Definitely not what you want to have happen in El Dorado. And then the next wave already has spawned, and I didn't even really get to this one. Uh... Yeah, this looks like a disaster. I think we're going to have to redo this and put my heroes closer to that drop spot. It looks like they've pretty much uh, wiped me out. And it's pretty laggy anyway, so... Um, I have one building left. Oh, my town hall's already been killed, so I can't even get a three-star. So, anyways, I lost. I deserve to lose. Let's try it again. But I'm going to change the hero placement quite a bit. So it took me way too long to get that first wave down, and it's because I was walking from the other side of the map. Now, I might not go this close initially. Um, this seems a little bit risky, but I'm just going to try it just because I want to hurry up and try and get this wave down. Um, again, start with the heals from Abyss Demon. Um, I'm going to do the taunt this time to... Uh, try and keep them up there. So, you know, my Abyss Demon has a lot to, to hit off of. There's at least, uh, what, each of the five monsters has about 20 mercenaries. So there's 100 mercenaries. Um, roughly 20 of them might be flying or whatnot, but that seemed to be way smoother. That, I don't, I didn't even, s oh, it's because I used my Great Sage. That's why it was so much smoother. Now, this is the risk that uh, you didn't want to have happen. Um, and that's when your heroes go to sleep. But the good thing is my landslide went to sleep and he actually teleported over. So that actually worked out perfectly. So that's a pretty nice drop um, for this level. And just to freeze those heroes, I'll go ahead and use my Great Sage. And yeah, I mean, this is going way better. You see how the hero placement really plays a huge role um, in how your overall success goes. So let's see if anyone's health starts to dip. I might do the landslide taunt. Um, I think we're okay. All right, we'll save it for another wave. All right, here we go, right beside it. So uh, it's really that uh, first wave to second wave that it can be problematic on this map, in my opinion. Um, we'll see how we go here on the final one. I did use... Did I use an allied win? I can't remember. I only have three right now. Uh, you have to check. Maybe you know. Maybe I used one in the last round, but... Uh, I, I didn't use anything yet, um, and my guys are going back to their bases already. It'd be great if Landslide makes it to his base before these uh, the final wave spawns, and it looks like he did. So that's uh, super convenient, and the final wave spawns right on top of him, but because he was at his base, he teleports over. So we're going to go ahead and see if we can burn these guys down pretty quick. I actually gave Ambrosia her own uh, allied win, which uh, you can do if you have conserved them like I have, and it looks like everyone's back to their base, and there's only this uh, air elite left. So there you have it. Super smooth um, once I fix the placement. Good luck to you.